One of the great events on the Black Power calendar is the run to the annual convention to be held in 1990 at Kawakawa. the gangs used to enjoy a full police escort when they were on a run. The cops would even pay for their gas. What's gonna happen now? We're gonna sit here and regroup and then shoot troop together. It seems to me not very much work going on inside Picky Mine. You mean what, what sort of work are you talking about? Employment. You mean useful activity or employment? I mean, you mean being paid for a job or utilising your day well? You tell me. What do they do? Well, I'm, I'm asking you, mate. I mean, you're, you're the one making the When they the go there every day... Yeah. What do they do? I know what they do. What do they do? guys went to hospital during the game, however the result was a foregone conclusion. The game went an extra 20 minutes longer so as to ensure an open win. <laughs> Celebrations that night were as full on as the game itself. One of the film crew was dealt a quick biff as a gentle reminder that they were bald heads, not gang members and sometimes it was quite obvious they didn't belong. What does the future hold for the gangs? Do the gangs have a future as such? Or will the league jersey replace the patch? History has proven that you cannot keep bundling people who don't conform off to prison. Will the government continue to supply an economic base from which the gangs can work from? Will they permit gang leaders to have a certain autonomy? Or will they allow the lid to be re-blown open? <laughs>